With this tutorial, I'm going to real quickly show you how to do slow motion in Premiere Pro. So I've got this bit here where the milk is coming in and it's being poured and I want to actually slow down the pour a little bit and then speed it back up. So in order to do that, we're going to do something called speed ramping. First thing you want to do is on your video, you've got this little icon here over to the left where it says FX. You want to right click on that go to time remapping and go to speed and you'll see it's active because it's got this white line here. Now we can start adding keyframes. So I can just, I'm going to expand this a little bit so it makes it easier to see. This is our ramping line. So to add a keyframe, I can just control click with my keyboard and click on it and you see we've got that keyframe there. I can also click add keyframe over here on the left or we've got our time remapping speed and we can add one up here in the effects control. Choose whichever one you prefer. So that's where it's going to start and then we get to here and we'll speed it back up. So I'm going to add another keyframe. Zoom in. Now what I want to do is I want this to kind of ramp and kind of slowly speed up and slow down or slowly slow down and speed up. So if I were just to direct, click in the middle here and pull it down, you can see what's happening is we get a percentage there popping up and it's telling me how much it's adjusting it by what percentage. So if I click here and start playing, you see it goes and then it slows down. But what I actually want it to do is I want it to slowly do that. So if you click here and drag to the right, what it's going to do is it's going to add a ramp and I'm going to do the same thing on the other end. And now when I pull down, you see what it does there? It, it adds this nice little ramp. So it's going to, it's not going to be so drastic. It'll slowly move its way into the slow motion. If I wanted to go even slower, just pull it down even more and it'll just keep going slower and slower as much as I want. And you can adjust this, like how quickly you want that to go. And you've got this here. So if I click on it, notice we got that blue bezel in the middle there with it clicked, you can also adjust how quickly or slowly. So you click on the end of the bezel, let's zoom in some more. And if you pull it left to right, you can see how it's going to kind of adjust it a little bit. So it's not, so maybe I want it to kind of come in and then real quickly go down, or I want it to stay at that nice smooth one that I've, that I've got there. So that's what you can do there. You can also do this in your effects controls if you want to adjust the length in between that bezel and so forth and so on. So that's pretty much it. That's how to do a slow motion effect in Premiere Pro. That's I think the best method for doing it. If you want to speed it up by the way, it's the exact same thing. Just click on that in the middle and go up instead of down and then you'll be speeding it up and then slowing it back down and adjusting how quickly you want that ramp to go. So this is really sharp. So I'm gonna click on that and just, just pull it a little to the left. Uh, one quick tip, you wanna use as quickly of a frame rate as you can with your camera. Notice on mine, it's 60 frames per second. I did this with my phone. That's the quickest option I have, but you wanna to try to go as high as possible. It helps keep it nice and smooth as you're adjusting the speeds those extra frames do.